everyone, thanks so much for clicking on this video. My name is Arielle Pierre with The Foraging Family and um, we are so excited to bring you this video. We were just thanking God for being able to be on this channel for two years now. We've received over a thousand likes, over hundreds of comments from you guys and those comments just fuel our channel and just really give us encouragement as we try to give you guys helpful and encouraging videos. One of our commenters um, shared a comment that asked us to do another um, Sabbath video and usually on Sabbaths we put away our phones and we really detach from technology but this Sabbath I asked everyone if it was okay if we can film and everybody voted yes <laughs> so we are going to film just um um how we spend our Sabbath now Sabbath is from Friday sundown to Saturday sundown and usually Friday is our preparation day. Um, do our cooking for Sabbath. We cook a big meal that we'll have on Friday night and Sabbath. We um, iron our clothes to get ready for church. Um, we clean the house, do some minimal cleaning and organizing and things like that. And most importantly, we welcome in the Sabbath with family worship. And that's what we're gonna do right now. So Every Sabbath, we put something special in this Sabbath treasure box just for the children, and it's always a surprise. What's in the box? I don't know. That's the exciting part. We don't know anything about what's inside. Yeah. We don't know. Deep, deep, deep. This Sabbath's present is, uh, I'm going to give you a clue as to what it is, and then a clue as to, you'll find a clue as to where it is. Okay? So here, Gabby, can you read this clue? As to what it is. Right here. Mm -hmm. And the Lord God formed man of the dust of the ground and breathed into his nostrils the breath of life and man became a living soul. Mm, wow. 
right? Mm. So that's a clue as to what it is. Go ahead and open up your open treasure chest to see the clue for where it is. Okay, there's a clue. You have to read the clue. Okay. I have black and white keys that don't open any doors. I have scales, but I'm not a fish. Mm. Where? What is that? Go look with the piano. Go see if you found a present. Oh, what is that? Bubbles. Bubbles. I'll have this one. Yeah. So, on what day did God make man? Friday. Six. Friday, right? The sixth day. That's when God breathed. <laughs> into man and he became a living creature. So did you know that every Sabbath is an opportunity to celebrate creation? Every Sabbath we, we recognize that who created this world? God! Exactly. Ah! Ooh. Boo, 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 boo. Draws closer to you as well in these Sabbath hours. Please be um, with Dad ahead of tomorrow's message, Lord, and I pray that you will speak uh, to and through him. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Happy Sabbath! Happy Sabbath! Happy Sabbath! Happy Sabbath! Happy Sabbath, Sabbath. 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 Sabbath to you and uh, the tune of Happy Birthday. Happy Sabbath. Sabbath to you. Happy Sabbath to you. Happy Sabbath to you. Happy Sabbath, everyone. Um, yesterday we had um, worship, which you guys saw, and this morning we just finished breakfast, and now we are out. We're gonna take a digestive walk. Um, we usually do that um, after breakfast uh, just to get our blood flowing, get the food digested, and um, it's a really nice, peaceful way to start our Sabbath mornings. Um, and both uh, my husband and I have, were born into Adventist homes, into loving Adventist homes. And so we've um, grown up with different Sabbath traditions and um, we just love creating different traditions for our family now that we have our own family. And one of those is just going for a morning walk. Um, and we try to do that before we get ready for church. We, this, we actually just started this about a couple years um, after my daughter was born. Um, before I used to take like an hour doing my hair and makeup and getting ready for church um, and the Lord uh, the Holy Spirit afflicted my soul about that instead of just focusing so much on my outward appearance before church I am um, I started focusing on just my heart um, preparing my heart to be ministered to at church and to be able to minister um, it's just been such a blessing to our family. We used to struggle getting to church on time, um, rushing out the door, getting um, frustrated with each other because we're late and we have the kids to get ready. Um, all of that was just, it was just too much. And we prayed and the Lord um, just <laughs> really brought to mind that it's about our hearts. Um, and Sabbath is about worship, not self-worship, but worshiping Him. So that changed the game for us, and our Sabbaths have been full of peace and joy ever since. So, yeah, so let's go on this walk, and um, I won't make this long, so I'm just gonna leave the phone, go on a walk, and then we'll head back inside to get ready for church. All right. Now we're on our way to church and the children are in the car with my parents and I'm here practicing my song for Sabbath. My dad is preaching this morning and I'm going to sing for special music. So, um, yeah.
Take that heart, the, the, the stubbornness in your heart, the thing that causes you to, to, to do the wrong thing. It says, I'm going to put a heart of, of flesh in there with my word, and it will cause you to follow me. God says, I know you can't by yourself, but I will help you because I want to make you a better person. The service was great. Um, I really appreciated my father's sermon. Uh, what did you think about it, babe? Just a message from God. Um, letting us know that he truly knows what we need um, and we might think we know what we want but if we trust him he will truly give us what we need and it will be abundantly and above anything we could ever have asked for ourselves amen and I didn't film me singing people need the Lord I forgot to tell my husband or my mom to film um, but I was so focused on uh, just getting up there and making sure that the music played properly that I you know forgot to do that but um, yes but that's the song I sing and no I'm not gonna sing it for you right now <laughs> but we're on our way home to go eat some manger eat some food all right So we just finished Sabbath lunch and just having really great fellowship with each other, talking about the sermon and um, keeping the conversation holy and uplifting. So now we're outside. Yeah, so we're gonna just go and take a little hike on the trail that we have on the property um, and call some family members. Usually today we love to call our family members that are um, far away. We like FaceTiming and things like that. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and take a hike and then at sunset We're actually gonna go take you guys to the bluff our favorite spot to see the sun set Let's go ahead and enjoy the rest of the Sabbath day. I found you a walking stick Thank you. All right, you got your stick? Yep. All right, let's go I hike know. We're here at the bluff, our favorite place to watch the sunset. salvation all ye who hear now to his temple draw near join ye in glad adoration that's fair all 
All right, thanks so much for tuning into this video, our Sabbath vlog. We hope that it inspires you to really enjoy the Sabbath as well with your family and friends. And we just want to say happy week, everyone. Happy, happy week. week, everyone. Happy week. <laughs>